Hey guys, this is Quinn, that's Nazi iPhone Guy. It's kind of late, the family's all asleep, that's not why I'm as exuberant as normal. But I, what I wanted to show you was uh, the video on a really cool application for Mac Madness Monday called Rivet. It's from the Little App Factory and it retails for $19.95. And this is an application that you know you really look at and say, oh, that's neat. But then you download it and it becomes something that you really cannot live without. Now the Little App Factory as a company itself has several applications in their suite that are all fantastic. Rivet is hand down the best uh, DVD ripper there is on the planet and it's very simplistic it doesn't rip or encode anything it just rips the raw audio and video TS files but I mean it's just a company that does things right and really simplistically so I wanted to show you rivet and uh, let me give you kind of a real-world example of how you'd use this our best stereo system in our house is downstairs in our family room, and it is our 7.1 Dolby digital surround sound we have amps and we have you know it's just a very expensive system and we don't have a CD player hooked up to it because it takes up a lot of space in the cabinets and also because we're not really a big CD family. We're big on digital downloads and all that other stuff out there. And so what Rivet allows us to do is stream our media, be it music, video, photos, uh, to our Xbox, our PS3, and our iOS devices around the home. This is great for iOS devices because if you have a 20 gigabyte video or you know you have a several you have a very large video library and you want to watch something on your iPad but you may not want to load all these movies onto your iPad you can do it wirelessly through your home using your computer network and it really works pretty great. Now you don't have to be on a Wi-Fi network uh, in order for this to copy and sync you just have to be on the same home network so my Xbox is wired and my MacBook is wireless but it all works the same and it works very well. So like I stated downstairs we have the PS3 hooked up to our TV and that's what we use to stream music to with Rivet but I'm going to show you how to do it on the Xbox 360 just because that's what I hooked up have hooked up to my computer and I can screencast that for you nice and easy. So uh, let's uh, show you what this is all about. First of all, Rivet is a very tiny little application. Uh, it's just a little menu bar widget, and there's a, there is a dock icon, and you can view your preferences here. But you know, it's very simplistic. You can choose whether you want to share your music. Um, movies and photos, uh, the, whether you want thumbnails generated for those, you can do uh, exactly what videos you want supported. It shows you the supported videos and that's the other great thing is a lot of the Xbox 360 uh, formats aren't supported and uh, you know the Xbox 360 only supports you know a pretty small library of these supported formats and so what Rivet will actually do is it will for example take an MKV file or a AVI file and actually convert that so that the Xbox 360 can play it and that is pretty neat. Uh, you can also choose your music and photos and where they lie along with your network and update preferences. So it's a pretty basic little application you can choose right from the menu bar whether you want something shared or something not to be shared and it's just a very simple application and that's how it works. But Let's show you the Xbox 360 portion of it. I have it screencasted here over beautiful composite video. I need to get an HD PVR because this simply doesn't work as it should. But, uh, you know, it does the job. So, can't complain too much. We boot up our Xbox 360 here. Everything works as it should. It's very loud, just as the Xbox 360 is. And, uh, you know, you'll be able to see instantaneously that our Rivet library is available. So, we're going to go into my Xbox. We're going to go into uh, video library. Uh, we'll go to music library for starters. We click it, and you'll be able to see that there are a bunch of different devices. You can do stuff from the hard drive, from the current disk, from portable devices, uh, like an external hard drive or a flash drive. But we're going to do it from our computer. Now, this is not hooked up to our computer. Uh, we don't have a USB cord going from our computer to the Xbox. It's using Rarit. Wow, Rarit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry guys, it is using Rivet and our wireless network or our wired network, really just our home internet network to stream all of this media. Now you can see immediately that we have all of our artists, all of our songs, and it works really well. I'll go to a royalty free song to uh, kind of show you the uh, in and outs of it. Sorry about this, it's a little bit slow tonight. My Xbox in specific and the capture card is not uh, top notch. I do have to upgrade once again, but we are going to go to QRS. I know my alphabet well. Sorry about this. Royalty free. We're going to click it and you'll be able to see all the songs so we can view songs. And this is pretty much just your Xbox Media Center. You can go to Beautiful Savage, which is a beautiful song, and you select it, and it allows you to play it. So we press play, and boom.
we're playing a royalty-free song on our Xbox 360 that is being streamed from our computer. Pretty cool. So you can then export that on your Xbox to your speakers around your house or whatever your Xbox is connected to. Pretty neat. I must say so myself. Uh, you can also do video. I mean, this works great if you have a really extensive iTunes movie library, but you don't really have one on your Xbox or your PS3. You may not have a Blu-ray or a DVD on hand. You just want to stream it. It actually works really incredibly well, and it's something that uh, is pretty surprising. So all you have to do is you select the iTunes folder. It'll present you with the movies folder. You pop that open, and uh, you can see all your movies that you have. And uh, you know, I can you can see that I don't have a lot in specific, but this is my home computer. Or, real computer does have quite a bit and you can instantaneously see um, you know your video it's pretty fantastic it's a great little system I've really liked it and uh, you know it's something that is pretty uh, phenomenal for sure so I mean it's an excellent way of streaming media for 20 bucks it's a pretty good deal uh, you don't have to drag media back and forth between your Xbox and your hard drive or your flash drive it's really just a seamless way of doing things and I really, really like it. So that's Rivet for Xbox 360, for PS3, for iOS devices. So long as you download the app, it's $19.99 from the Little App Factory. Uh, this is one of my favorite applications I've ever purchased, and I'd recommend that you do the same. It's an absolute hoot. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe, rate, comment. Sorry for my, again, pretty quiet voice. And as always, stay snazzy. See you later, folks.